Cooking with Loco episode 1! Yay! Welcome to the first episode of the best cooking show in the world. Maybe. Ho hopefully. So welcome to my kitchen. By the way, a little disclaimer. This is my first time cooking fish. I have zero experience. Well, almost zero experience in the kitchen. I think the last time I cooked in my channel, this happened. Hopefully that doesn't happen again. So here we are guys. Welcome to my kitchen. Uh, we have all the ingredients set up. This is the pangaceous or the cream dory we caught the other day. Look at this. Look at this fish. I'm done. We, to... we did it. We harvested these amounts of meat. This is just a portion of the nine kilograms of cream dory we had so you know just i just cook enough for me because i don't want to kill everyone in my family here so just enough for me i guess so what i'm planning for today is i'll be cooking the cream dory filet in butter that's it it's a recipe i learned from <laughs> i'll be using a recipe i've tasted before in a friend's house Thank you kay, uh, kay Papi Balta. I, I haven't consulted him about this. I'm probably stealing his recipe for this and I'm gonna recreate it by memory. Alright? Uh, from what I remember, the only thing he used was, well, of course, the filet. Some random spices. I think I remember that he used rosemary. I'm gonna put in a bit of thyme or basil there just in case. I don't know. Some garlic and butter. And olive oil so that's all you need for this recipe so what am i gonna do here first off i am going to turn on the heat literally there you go so put that on medium heat put a bit of olive oil just so that we don't scorch the butter later on there you go see that just a bit of olive oil Laser right over there. Nice. You know, I think I might have put too much oil. Maybe, just maybe. I, I don't know. So heat it up just a bit. Now, next, you take the butter, just probably a half freaking slab of butter. Just half of it. No, I don't know if I should use salted or unsalted, but I'm using salted right now. I don't even know if you need a special kind of butter, but I do remember him using butter all right what you do is you melt it there you go look at that awesome you know the, doing this kind of makes sense I, it kind of looks like it makes sense no all right yeah it's too See, much. It's too no it's not too You're much gonna butter? no i'm gonna fry it on butter That's it's called bait i'll show you later shut the fuck so, while we're waiting for the butter to melt, you see this? The filet of uh, pangaceous. What you do is you just lightly salt it. Just do I do the salt bay? No? Just lightly salt it. There you go. Just salt it. There you go. There you go. Awesome. We, it's now salted. Then you put a bit of pepper on it. It. There you go. I'm trying to act as if I know what I'm doing. Okay. Those are screaming children. I have no idea what's happening to them. Please don't call the cops. And then that's it. You got yourself salted and uh, maybe just, uh, just a bit more salt. Yeah. Just, there you go. Awesome. Now let's check with the butter here. Looks like it's going well. That butter smells really nice. Next, you get the cloves of garlic. I pre-prepared a while ago. I crushed it already. Just put it in there. There you go. 
leave it there for a bit. No, so far, mm, I can smell the butter and the garlic. <sighs> smells good. Does it smell good, Lorenzo? Nice. Awesome. So while we're waiting for the garlic to get um, cooked, uh, let me tell you something about the pangaceous fish. For those who didn't know, we butchered this last night. And it's awesome. Alright, look at that. Kinda looks like tuna, right? Totally different from the cream dory you get from the market that's all white. Now you know. <laughs> it actually looks like salmon, sorry. But it's not. It smells a whole lot fishy. Okay, so I think I'm burning the fucking butter now. Oh god. Oh no, I burned the... I burned the, I burned the butter. I burned the butter. I have to... I have to do it again. Shit. Okay. I think this is good. Alright, we're back in track, boys. Now, the pièce de résistance, we put the fillet in. There you go. Five minutes or three minutes per side. There you go. Nice. 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 Hey, it's too much. Give it the room. That's it, that's it. Okay, that's all I, I need. There you go. Why are you talking, producer? Sir? It was triggered somehow. No, that's it. Alright, so three minutes per side should be good. Keep the butter moving. So it doesn't freaking get, um, doesn't get burned. So while you're doing this, you baste the fish. Basting is at the. You're bathing the fish with the, <laughs> with the butter. Is that where they got the term baste? There you go. Just keep doing that. Beautiful. I think we have the heat on an optimal level because it hasn't browned yet. So let me know if it's three minutes. <laughs> By the way, guys, for those who are cooking experts, I know you guys are cringing, especially during the butchering of this fish. Fish, but if uh, if you see me doing something bad or wrong, do let me know in the comments below. I do want to learn. All right. I'm actually taking this very seriously, guys. You see, this is a fish is changing color. It's, 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 it's like cooking mama, you know? You have to communicate. Not about three minutes. Five seconds. Five, five. Four, three, two, one. Three minutes. Flip the fish. There you go. Wow, look at that. Look at that. That's a cooked side. Awesome. I'm actually forward for this fish. It's act it actually smells nice. Yeah, I was up. Oh, a bit scorched there, but it's good. Keep basting. Three minutes again. Now, on the one minute, fifth, uh, 30 second mark, let me know, because we're going to do something. We're going to do something with the rosemary. Alright. Look at this spice. We're going to add that up during the last minute. Or last minute and a half. Because this will add a better aroma and possibly a better flavor. Alright? Why are we gonna add it on the one, uh, one minute 30 second mark? Because we don't want it burning <laughs> with the butter. Base, 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 base. All right, one minute, 50 seconds, let's do this. Just add a bunch of this in there. Oh my god. <laughs> Whoa! Dude, that aroma is so good! What is this thing? Mm, damn. Come on, come on. Add some more, bro. Oh, dude, it smells nice! No wonder they're called spices. It makes a difference. They're also yo smell this shit. Smell this shit. Yeah. Producer son. Smell this shit. <laughs> what? Yeah, it smells nice. Huh? See? It smells nice. Yeah, it smells nice. I'm gonna add more. <laughs> okay, that's it. I'm not gonna add the freaking basil because it smells really nice as it is. So I think we're good. I think we were good with this. So I'm gonna turn off the heat, let it base for a few 
few more minutes. Probably until the heat dies down. And then I'm gonna serve it up for you guys. Dude, look at this! It actually looks like food. Dude, it actually smells like the dish I tasted before. Damn, I'm actually proud. But you know what? We have to taste it first. So, let's do it. Some people say that to test if it's uh, cooked, it goes through. It's cooked, it's cooked. It's soft. Look at that, guys. Look at it. Whoop! We're not done yet. Watch this. Hell yeah! Look at the way I'm putting it there! <laughs> Look at that! Subarashi ne! ne! This is awesome! Dude, I'm actually proud! It looks like food! It smells like one too! <laughs> awesome! I'm gonna take a picture of this! Look at this, yes! Ain't it nice? It smells good. You know what? Verdict. Let's do it. Let's uh, let's finally taste it. Any volunteers? You? No? You? Cowards! All right, here goes nothing, boys. Watch this. Come on. Do a zoom in. Ooh wee. Look at that. It's cooked inside. Let me see. Nope, no more of that fishy smell. It's time to taste it. Itadakimasu! Mm. Oh, damn. You know, I wish I could have added more garlic. It's pretty good. No bias here. It's good. It's not like gourmet level, but it's good. It's not shit. No, to be honest. The thyme gives it a bit of an accent. The butter, can't really taste it that much. The fish, a bit salty, but it's not like that salty like where you go, Bleh. no. It's like, mmm. Here, but unbiased. But come on, this one bite. I'm getting paid for this, right? No. Oh. Ah! We're all dying together! <laughs> oh, honestly, for me. Eh? Eh? I can't <laughs> say, but it tastes like one of those restaurant things. It does See, taste I good. told you. I told you, boy! Lorenzo! Come on, man. C come here. Come here, Lorenzo. Let, let me hold that shit. <laughs> Ayo! Mm -hmm. I mean, it's not that tasty. Right? It has flavor. I mean, but I'd still eat it. Mm -hmm. See? Mm -hmm. So it doesn't taste like crap! Woo! I did it! I didn't fail. That's that's what's important for me. I didn't fail. Wait now, El. Let's go. Let's let's get the other people taste it. We're gonna poison them as well. Taste it. No. Taste it. No. Taste it. No. Stop playing Minecraft and taste it. Wow. Wow. He took. Oh, he's gonna die. He's gonna die. He's gonna die. He's gonna die, Chris. Bro, how was it? How is it? I mean, it is pretty nice. See, I told you guys! Now leave me alone. Stop playing Minecraft. We're supposed to be playing Minecraft! It's time. It's time, Vanilla. No, what? you eat that first. I mean, it already did! We're, it tastes nice! We already did. Wait, wait, wait. Can I see you eating it? <laughs> Everyone doesn't want to die here. Huh? Of course. I think okay. that, that, that piece. Tasted really nice. <laughs> is it yum? Yes, it is. It's 
Stop playing serious, you're going to taste it right now. I will catch this and then. <laughs> I don't. See, I clutch this and then I eat. <laughs> what if I press the power button? <laughs> no, just eat it. Just eat it. Yeah, there you go. Nice. Okay. Uh, go eat, eat one with the butter and the and the garlic. Para, uh, I don't know. Kabala. There you go. All I can say. Oh, is stop being a coward and eat one piece. Time to die. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Parang manok. That's his honest opinion. Parang manok. There you go. <laughs> Neil, wala ka magagawa. Dito na kami. Neil. It's time, man. It's time. Stop playing GTA 5! <laughs> Stop playing GTA 5! Kain na dito! Parang naman lahat kami kumain dito. Kung mamamatay tayo. Kumain na ba? Oo. Ayun, nakabideo na nga eh. Kaya tayo mamamatay dito. Kaya... Ah, yun ang nga? <laughs> Oo. Oh. Kaya wala nga tiwala sa akin. Gago ko ka. Kaya yun yung pinakahuli sa lag mo. Ma-upload. <laughs> it's an episode lang! Ito mo yung butter, parang masarap. Parang nang yung cream dory na lang. Ah, yung si garlic, ha? Eh? Oh, ano, honest opinion. Sarap na sarap. Ano yung masasabi mo? Masarap lang. Ano yung ano? Sa base description na ano. Oh, putang ina! Kumain na isa! <laughs> ah, natak ka mang gaga. <laughs> sarap na sarap. Tara yung barangay naman pa, kasunin natin. <laughs> no, don't! Don't worry, it's okay. Alright, ito kinain ko rin. Okay na. Okay na. And there you have it, guys. Cream Dory, fried and basted on butter with garlic and rosemary i think i should have added i think the best thing we could do here to add more flavor to add more oomph to it maybe i should have added lime or lemon no i think it would have tasted a lot better with lemon feeling ko talaga lemon something to like complement the saltiness something acidic yeah so there you go maybe i'll try it next time maybe you guys can try it next time with lemon see for yourself all right Feeling ko lemon yung kulang dito. But anyways, there you go. Our first episode of Cooking with Ilaco. I hope you guys look forward for my other or future catch and cook videos. And hopefully I don't mess up like a while ago. And for those who are cooking experts, chefs, or just cooking enthusiasts, if I did anything wrong, if I need anything to improve on, do let me know in the comment section. I'd love to learn. Alright? Whew! That's it. We did it. We did. We, we probably have like five days to live before we start um, experiencing experience gastric stuff. Maybe. This maybe. Oh, you, oh. You're gonna die, Lorenzo. <laughs> and that's it, guys. Thank you very much for watching Cooking with Love episode one. Look forward for the future ones, and I'll see you guys again next time. Look at that. Woohoo! Mm. 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 Mm.